Hey everybody, today we'll be discussing how to link your job link tools to your S-Man manifold. There are two methods to accomplish this. Let's dive into the first method, which involves using the link tool button on the front of the device. The link tool button is a general search of the area for supported field piece wireless tools. One, ensure that your job link tools are powered on. If your job link system tool has a selector switch, ensure it's set to match the measurement. Two, press the link tool button on the front of the manifold. Use the arrow keys to toggle to yes to auto search. Press select. The wireless option is defaulted to off. When you select search, it will turn wireless on automatically. Four, the S-Man will search and pick the first tool to assign for you. The first one it found was the return airside psychrometer, ID3075. Press select to link the tool, then it returns you to the main screen. To link more tools, press the link tool button again and select yes to search. The S-Man will search and found the supply airside psychrometer, ID3076. Press select to link your tool. To link more tools, press the link tool button again and select yes to search. The S-Man will search and found the suction line temperature pipe clamp, ID7041. Press select to link your tool. Press the link tool button again and select yes to search. The S-Man will search and found the liquid line temperature, ID7042. Press select to link your tool. At this point, you should have both your suction line and liquid line temperatures linked, as well as your return and supply air. However, you might notice that the outdoor dry bulb is missing. With the latest S-Man's SM482V and SM382V, you can link the outdoor dry bulb to a JL3RH psychrometer instead of the Type-K thermocouple. Here's how. One, ensure that the job link psychrometer is powered on. Two, Press the Link Tool button and select Search. 3. Scroll through the options to find the outdoor dry bulb temperature with psychrometer ID7281. Press Select to link your tool. Let's dive into the second method, which involves using the Menu and Toolset function. Make sure that your job link tools are powered on. This method, we are going to go through the menu option instead of the link tool button. Press menu. Scroll till we get to tool set and select tool set. Depending on the wireless tool, select unlink type K or onboard to set a source to its factory default source. In the tool set menu, scroll through and find the wireless sources you want to assign. Let's go to our suction line temperature. Type K is the default option. Press select to change from the Type K to the wireless option. Use the arrow keys to toggle between Type K and wireless options. If your wireless is off, selecting this option will turn it on. The S-Man located our JL3PC temperature probe. Press select to link your tool. This will bring you back to the main screen. Hit menu again. This time it'll bring you right back to the tool set menu. Press select. Use the arrow keys to toggle to the liquid line measurement. Now we are going to press select to change off of the type K onto the wireless and hit select. Press menu, then tool set. We'll do the outdoor dry bulb this time. So we are going to change it off the type K. Press select. We have a choice of manual entry or to add a JL3RH. I have three different psychrometers available, so I can scroll through here and select which one I want to choose. 7281 is the psychrometer I am looking for. Hit select to link the tool. Press menu, then tool set. Return air has an option of manual entry, or you can add the wireless JL3RH. Press select to link your tool. Press menu, then tool set. Then we will link our supply side as well. Now we have our liquid line 
and our suction line pipe clamps linked, as well as our outdoor dry bulb psychrometer. We also have our supply and return air psychrometers linked up to your S-Man manifold. You also have the option to link up your wireless vacuum gauge, MG44. So we'll select tool set, scroll to vacuum. There is an onboard vacuum gauge, so you can choose either your onboard vacuum gauge or wireless option. Press select to change to the wireless gauge. Press select to link your tool. And then we will also go ahead and link the wireless refrigerant scale, SR47. Press menu, then tool set. Scroll to scale and select to link your tool. Scroll to weight and press select to link your tool. And there you have it. That is how to link your job link tools to your S-Man manifold. Thank you for watching and be sure to like and subscribe for more videos. See you next time.